Hello everyone. I'm Prathamesh Jaju, your astro buddy. Today I'm going to show you how to use the Pi Matrix Phoenix telescope. It is a refractor telescope with altitude azimuth mount. So the first step that we are going to do here is set up the telescope. If you haven't set up the telescope already, please click on the link above. After that, we are going to remove the dust cap which protects the telescope from dust and moisture. The next step is very easy. Just loosen the screws and point to the desired object with the help of this finder. So we are going to point towards the moon right now, which is here. I'm pointing the telescope towards moon. Okay, now we have spotted it and we are just tightening the screws to lock the position. And this finder scope has a cross arrow. So we have to bring the moon at the center of the cross arrow. So we'll just do it minutely by moving the telescope very slowly. Okay, that's done. Now we are going to look through the main telescope. So yes, we have the moon here and now we are going to focus it with the help of this focuser. Slowly moving it until we reach the perfect focus. If the object is moving out of frame, use the slow motion knob to track the object precisely. To view the moon in different magnifications, we use different types of eyepieces. So we have attached a 20mm eyepiece right now. So with this eyepiece, we can see the complete disk of the moon. So if you want to see the closer details of the lunar surface, which are the mountains and craters of the moon, we are going to use a smaller eyepiece. So the smaller the eyepiece, the greater the magnification. As the Phoenix telescope doesn't support mobile phone adapters because of the high weight of the mobile phones. But if you still want to take pictures of the night sky with a mobile phone, what you can do is a small trick. You take out your mobile phones, place the mobile phone above the eyepiece and take a picture. So that was all about the Phoenix telescope. Hope you had fun. Let us know if you have any doubts in the comment section. Thank you so much and happy stargazing.